Hey y'all, good morning. So I am on my way to get into this car so I can go to work. All right y'all, hold on. I have so much stuff in my hand and I'm trying not to drop my phone. Hold on y'all. Hey y'all, so what is up? Good morning. Happy Tuesday. Y'all, I'm on my way to work and I'm so excited y'all because my perfume came, I guess last night, we did get a notification but it was raining so bad out here last night that I didn't feel like coming to get the package. So y'all, I got it this morning out of the mailbox and I'm just super duper excited. It is a perfume. And it's a perfume that I actually saw on TikTok. Y'all, I need to stay off of TikTok because TikTok is just, <laughs> TikTok is dangerous. I be buying up everything, y'all. Someone uh, was on TikTok talking about a cherry oil scent. And this cherry oil, you can actually mix in with perfumes. You can mix in, um, you can make soaps and lotions. You can use it as a diffuser. You can put a few drops in your shower to make your shower smell good in your bath. And the oil is so good. Like if you love a good cherry scent, hold on y'all. Y'all know I have to concentrate while I back out y'all. All right. But as I was saying, if you all enjoy like a good cherry scent, then that oil, oh girl, it is so freaking good. And I have this, um, I showed y'all the perfume that I picked up from Rue 21. It's an almond scent. So I've been mixing those two and I've been getting like so many freaking compliments. It smells so freaking good, especially because the weather is changing and so it just cuts through this crisp weather. Y'all, I freaking love it. I'm gonna have to order me another one, like for sure. Cause I've been using that um, combo like every single day. I'm gonna go to Rue 21 and get me another perfume. Cause I love that perfume, y'all. And it was only $15. And it lasts, it don't really last long, but it just, it smells so freaking good. It lasts on my skin for about, I guess I got probably about a two hour wear. No. I guess I got probably about a four hour wear, y'all, out of that perfume, which is not long at all. Cause I'm so used to, um, I gotta sneeze. I'm so used to my perfumes lasting me um, for at least six hours. So it don't really last long, but that's okay. But I noticed that when I, whenever I wear the oil, but I have noticed that whenever I wear the oil, with the perfume, it lasts a lot longer, obviously. So y'all, but I love it so much. And then the perfume that I, that came on last night. And then y'all, the perfume that came last night is actually um, a chocolate scented perfume. So I've never owned like a chocolate scented perfume in my collection. So I can't wait to try that y'all. I wanted to wear it today, but then I was like, no, because I have to see what it's given before I wear it in the office. So I was like, let me not wear it today. But I'm gonna wear it tomorrow, okay? So yeah, my lips is so dry. So y'all, um, like I said earlier, I'm headed to work. Um, I might, I've been thinking about getting off early today. Only because I just, um, only because I have, like, I have some things to do. That I can't do on the weekend. So I'm thinking about getting off early today versus tomorrow because um, again, tomorrow's Wednesday, but Wednesday we have so many meetings like back to back. So it wouldn't be ideal for me to get off early tomorrow. But today I'm really thinking about it. I did bring my computer home yesterday because we lost power in the office yesterday right when I was about to wrap up things. We lost power. And normally at the end of the day, I have to send like multiple emails to different people. Um, and that's mandatory. Like those emails, they must be sent. And I couldn't send them yesterday due to us losing power. So I just basically um, brought my computer home and sent those emails. So, since my computer, since I had my computer at home, I just took advantage of getting some other stuff done. 
so I can, you know, actually leave early today. And I'm talking about maybe around noon. And I normally don't get off till like 5, 5.30. So that's what I'm going to do today. Y'all, I haven't decided on what I want to do for my birthday. Um, we were actually talking about, my sisters and I, we were actually talking about um, potentially going to like a painting sip. We were thinking about that. Um, a paint and twerk, because <laughs> that was on the list too. Um, I was also thinking about like picking a really nice restaurant to go to, so that is an option. And then I also was thinking about like having something at my house. So I don't know, y'all. I'm still like I'm still like up in the air about what it, what it is I really want to do. I'm not 100% sure. And today is what? What's today's date, y'all? I don't, I don't even know. That's a shame. Let me see. Today is the 13th. Today is September 13th. My birthday is September 21st. I only have like a week to think about what I want to do. My birthday is on a Wednesday. I will not be working on my birthday. So I'm going to take my birthday off. Um... And I don't, I don't really have anything planned the day of my birthday. I just want to, like, not be working. Okay, so I'm not going to work on my birthday. Hubby is going to try to see if he can get off on my birthday. It depends on who else is off. And if he gets if he gets off, then, of course, we'll probably, like, spend the day together. Maybe go out for breakfast or lunch or dinner or whatever. So, but that's, that following Saturday, which is the 24th, is when I want to celebrate my birthday. Saturday so I'm just trying to figure out and I can just as well like have something at the house you know ain't no ain't no biggie I can just have something at the house um entertain right on my deck and just turn up honey okay like Dennis and I do every single weekend <laughs> truly like we turn up every single weekend so I can just as well do that but I don't know we'll, I don't know we'll see we'll see so yeah y'all I'm not talking about much I guess I'll get off of here because the highway is so like it's a lot of people on the highway this morning a lot of people so let me um hang up with y'all and I'll talk to y'all uh oh let me get over this big truck I'm trying to get over like he didn't see me right there like anyway what is he doing alright y'all so I'm gonna go ahead and um hang up i'll call y'all back a little later on when i get home this evening i am or this afternoon rather i'm gonna show you all the um the body the cherry body oil that i ordered from amazon and i'm gonna also unbox the perfume that i picked up from amazon because i'm so freaking excited about both like Oh y'all, I smell so, I smell like cherry almond right now. It smells so good, it smells so good. I can't, it smells so good. And I try not to like, I try not to like go too ham because I am like, I load up my fragrances y'all. And I know I shouldn't do that going into the office, but I just like, I love to smell good. And I just love to smell me like all day. And I know that um, the perfume that I put on really don't last a long time. So I'm not going to lie. I kind of, your girl kind of went in with the perfume. But yeah, it smells divine. But anyway, y'all, let me get off of this camera. And I will holler at you guys um, when I get off from work, okay? Yeah. <laughs> So I just got off from work. Y'all, yeah, I only worked half a day today. Um, I did bring my stuff home because it's a few documents that I need to go over before tomorrow. Um, so I did bring my stuff home. It's currently 1224. And it's 1224. And I'm gonna take this stuff upstairs. This is all of my computer um, my computer stuff. I'm going to go ahead and take upstairs and set it up because um I need to look at some stuff when I get back. I am going to um, run to Dollar General because I'm looking for more lip gloss, y'all. 
like I have been so loving the LA color lip oils and I normally buy them all up um, whenever I go to Dollar Tree but I just ran out well I have a little left and y'all saw me use it this morning but I have just this much left y'all so I'm gonna go to Dollar Tree to see if I can find some more lip oil and then just to look around and see what they have for the fall so that's what I'm going to do once I um, unpack my bag and then I need to use the restroom and then we're gonna go to Dollar, um, Dollar Tree so I shall be right back all right y'all y'all it is so nice out here today it's 80 degrees and it's beautiful it's so pretty out here today it's gorgeous and it looks like it's gonna rain so let me hurry up and get to Dollar Tree so I can get back I'm gonna go to the Dollar Tree let me plug my phone up but I'm gonna go to the um I'm gonna go to the Dollar Tree in Ashland. So Lego. My neighbors is getting their house power washed. I wanna see what it's gonna look like when I come back. So y'all, I have been wearing blush lately. I'm addicted to blush again. And I actually have some blush on right now and hold on y'all um it's been so funny because oh it's kind of warm y'all in this car and i need to get gas but um it's been so funny because my co-worker came in because all i wear for work y'all hold on let me turn, turn this corner hold on uh, let me turn this corner then i have another corner to turn let me turn this corner. The this non-skid mat that I have for my um for my camera works pretty good, but I'm always scared that my camera's gonna tip over. But anyway, I need to roll this corner down just a little bit, y'all. But um I do not wear foundation. I don't wear foundation, but y'all, I do not wear foundation anymore. And not because I don't like foundation. It's just that, you know, I can just use concealer and powder. So that's what I've been doing. And I haven't even, um, okay. And I haven't like had the urge to even, um, ooh, that car is coming quick. I hope you get over. But um, I haven't even had the urge y'all to like buy foundation. So I haven't, I haven't like purchased any foundation. I have so much concealer though. I have like, and my favorite concealer right now is from e.l.f. So right now I use the e.l.f. concealer and then I just use like um, a finishing powder over top. And that's all I, that's all I do y'all. And I do use the e.l.f. power grip primer. So basically, um, and I don't know how like my skin is looking right now because I've had this um, concealer and powder on like since six o'clock this morning. And it's currently one o'clock so it's been on practically like all day pretty much so i don't know like how my skin is looking right now in this camera it looks pretty good as far as i can see but that's all i wear y'all so i said all of that to say that i have been like obsessed with blush and i have been like watching like so many videos on um how to apply blush for my face shape right and so basically um i watched a video from wayne goss and he was talking about like i gotta roll this one though y'all it is so hot hold on Woo! it's hot i want to turn the air on but then it's going to be too loud i think but um i was watching wayne goss and he was talking about like how to apply blush for your face shape and then what kind of brush to use and so um yeah y'all i have been like applying the blush and i don't know if y'all can see it um i don't know if y'all can see why i have to roll this one up y'all because i feel like y'all can't hear me it's so loud but i don't know if you guys can see but i have like an oval face shape and Wayne Goss was like, the blush for my face shape needs to be applied like right, um, like right up in here, like right here. And he recommended a stipple brush. 
like a small stipple brush so y'all I have been just like loving that placement because at first I was putting my blush like on my cheeks and I felt like I was looking like clownish like and I really didn't like it and I have so much blush y'all that I don't even use but since I've started like putting my blush up here I just like it like so much more so I don't know if y'all can see it because I didn't go ham because of course I was going to work but I have on um, sweet as cocoa on my cheeks right now and it's so like I, I love it so much like I can just like I can like see the difference in my makeup with the blush and the application and where I applied it and it's so funny because um one of my co-workers came in this morning and she was like oh my god I don't know like what you're doing with your makeup nowadays she said but it just I just love it it looks so pretty and I was like yeah because I'm only wearing like concealer and powder and then I've been wearing blush so yeah y'all I really do like it let me know if y'all can see it y'all probably can't see it I don't know but when I look in the mirror I can see it like and it looks so pretty I absolutely just love it y'all but anywho whoo y'all I'm gonna have to turn my air on because now I'm hot now I'm hot I am hot so I have got to turn this air on and I'll holler at y'all when I get to the Dollar General. I'm going to put my shades on. Oh, let me try my shades on for y'all. I picked up these shades from Dollar Tree. I said Dollar General. I meant Dollar Tree, y'all. Look at these shades I picked up from Dollar Tree. I showed y'all these in my last haul. Let me try them on. I love them. I still keep checking the Dollar Tree to see what kind of shades I can find. Thanks to TikTok. <laughs> but let me see. Let me put these on. Y'all, I love these. Look. Oh, child. I love these freaking shades. I love how big they are. I love the tint. It has like this um, pinky orangey tint. And yeah, they are so freaking cute. They are like a baby pink. And they are so freaking cute, y'all. And they were only a dollar and a quarter. And I love them. I love them. So freaking cute. Tell me what y'all think about my shades. But anywho, I need to turn my air on, y'all, because I'm, I'm so hot right now. Like, I'm so hot. So I'm gonna go ahead and turn the air on and then I will talk to you guys like once I get to the dollar and quarter store. show you all the perfume and the oil that I picked up from Amazon then I needed to wash my dishes so um, Dollar Tree I picked up some party mix and as y'all can see I've been eating them on the way home so delicious so I got those I saved the rest for hubby because I was turning them up in the car y'all I was so freaking hungry and so yeah I got those and then I got this um, chalkboard crop it sticker and it looks like this and I don't know why I brought this sticker like I'm thinking about this DIY that I want to do to a shelf that I have in my bathroom and so yeah that's why I brought it like so I do know why I brought it but that's why I got it y'all so I just got like one and it looks like this y'all and I just got this just to test it out to see how it would work on my shelf as far as like sticking to the um, shelf and if it sticks good then I'll go back and get more because I'm trying to cover the top of that shelf with like a black sticker like this 
So yeah, I thought I had to order something like this from Amazon, but I was shocked to um, find it in Dollar Tree. So I'm trying to get it to focus, there it is. So as you can see, it's like one huge sheet of just like plain black sticker. So it looks like that. All right, there we go. Oh, actually it's two pieces. Y'all can see there, okay? And then y'all, I picked up these stickers right here. These really pretty like glass-like stickers. And I'm going to put these in my planner. I thought they were really, really cute. And then I picked up my absolute favorite lip oil. And here it is. Y'all, this is the LA Color Lip Oil. And I think I showed y'all this lip oil in another vlog when I went to Dollar Tree. That I think is going to be up before this video, I think. But yeah, y'all, I love this lip oil. This was the only one. You guys saw that in the store, the last one. Um, and it's just so good. It's really moisturizing. It's not sticky at all. It is just wonderful. And of course, I saw people talk about this on TikTok. So... Head to like I love this y'all I love it so freaking much it's the best lip oil ever so that was the only one I could find I went to the Dollar Tree um near my job and they were sold out so yeah y'all I have to go to another Dollar Tree and when I find this I like to pick up like three or four because I go through this like nobody's business I put this on like when I wake up in the morning brush my teeth I put this on I put it on throughout the day while I'm in my car um before I go to bed because it's so moisturizing so I love this lip oil by LA color and again that's what it looks like in case you guys want a screenshot so y'all can look for when you're in the Dollar Tree then y'all I picked up this LA color foundation but I'm going to actually use it as a concealer and here's what it looks like and I have it in the shade chestnut and it looks just like a concealer like just like a concealer y'all so it says matte so I can't wait to use this. I will let you guys know what this is hitting on. All right, y'all. So then next I picked up a whole bunch of products. Well, not a whole bunch, but some things by Ayani. And this is the company that makes um, the lashes that I absolutely love. And I didn't see any lashes. No, I did. I saw some lashes in there. Um, but they really didn't have like a good selection of the lashes at this Dollar Tree. But they had some other stuff. And I actually showed y'all right before this clip. So let me just show y'all what I got. So... I feel like I'm missing something. Let's see. Oh, I got it right here. All right. So from Ayani, I picked up um this brow gel, and it's just like a clear brow gel. Because some days, um, oops, I'll get that in a second. But some days I do not feel like filling my brows in. I just want to like like shape them and tame them a little bit. And so I needed another um clear brow gel. So I got this one in the package, and it's just so cute. I love that. So yeah, we'll see how this works. I'll keep you guys posted. Okay, so I like that y'all. And then y'all, I picked up two of the blushes because we were just talking about how much your girl loves a blush. And so this is the first one that I got. And this one is so freaking pretty, you guys. And the reason why I got this is because obviously the shade is gorgeous. Like this is my favorite um, kind of shade. It is so, so, so pretty y'all. I love this rose shade. I think that's going to look gorgeous on my skin tone. And then I also got it because look at this y'all. It is Virgo. Had to. Like how could I not get this? So yeah y'all that's Virgo. I had to do it. I had to do it. And it has Virgo right here on the top as you can see. So this is the Zodiac blush. Really really pretty. And this one is called Baby Rose. And the name is really appropriate because that's what it looks like like a mauve rose shade so pretty and then i picked up this one right here and this blush is called peach and i just absolutely love like the packaging y'all like the packaging is so pretty this is from the electric electric jungle collection as you can see there and they also had like lashes to match these all right but the lashes sold out really really quickly and so this is like a peachy type blush they also had some shimmer blushes, but I'm really not into like shimmer blushes, y'all. I love matte blushes. So again, this one is Baby Rose and this one is Peach. And they um, look really similar, for real. Like if you look at it, they look really, really similar. So yeah, I'm so excited. I cannot wait to use these blushes, y'all. I can't wait. All right, y'all. So from Amazon, okay, TikTok made me buy this oil. I was scrolling on TikTok. I need to stay off TikTok. TikTok, like, oh, God, y'all. Y'all be on TikTok. 
Y'all, I be on TikTok. I see all these things and I just want to like order everything. But I saw this girl talking about this oil right here. If it will focus, here it is. So this is called Red Cherry. And this oil you can use as a diffuser. You can use it to make soaps. You can mix it in with perfumes, obviously. You can mix it in with lotions. Like so many things, y'all. The list goes on and on. And so I mixed it in, in with my Jersey's, um Cherry Almond Lotion. And y'all, this stuff took the lotion up like 10, like 10 notches. It smells so freaking good. And I also like mix this in with Vaseline because Vaseline obviously has no scent to it and so this is just so good mixed in with Vaseline it just lasts on my skin all day long when I mix it with Vaseline y'all it is so freaking good and then I sprayed some of my perfume on top of it the one that I showed you guys in the last vlog I think the vlog before this one that I got from Rue 21 oh my god the um almond scented perfume yes i mixed it with this y'all so freaking good but this oil is everything it just like when you use it whatever room you're in it lights up the entire room it came with a black cap on it and then it came with this dropper okay so you can just like drop the oil but if y'all know anything about oil perfumes they just last longer than your traditional perfumes anyway like but y'all if you guys are into like cherry smells this one is everything and in my humble opinion it does not smell synthetic to me it smells amazing so i'm so happy to have this y'all and let me know if you guys want me to drop the link down below because if you do i will so here's what it looks like y'all it came in a regular white box like this okay so i'm just gonna stick it back in here until i get upstairs but that thing smells so freaking good and then I picked up a perfume. Ooh, you guys, you guys, OMG. So here goes the perfume. Let me make sure you guys can see this good. There it is. All right, that's what the box looks like. And this perfume is called Coco Musk. All right. Y'all, I'm just so excited. I'm trying to see if there's notes on the box. And I don't see any notes. It has the ingredients, but I don't see any notes. But obviously, you guys will know that it has like a chocolate scent to it because it's called Coco Musk, okay? So that's the box. And the volume is 80%, and this is a 1.65 fluid ounce bottle, okay? Again, it came from Amazon. So let's look at the packaging. Ooh. Ooh. So here is what it looks like. Oh, I like that, y'all. It just looks so sleek and classy. And look at the juice. The juice is like an amber color. Really pretty, y'all. Oh, gosh. I'm so excited about this. I'm so excited. So let's see. Comes with this top, and the top is pretty hard. Does it screw off or? Hold on, y'all. Y'all had a hard time getting this top off, but here's what the top looks like. Here is the atomizer. And I'm not gonna spray any on me, y'all, because, um, yeah, I still smell like cherry. Although, chocolate cherry might smell good, but yeah, I just wanna test this without having anything else on. But let's see. Let's see, I'm gonna spray a little on the box. And I don't even wanna waste it, but it's okay, because it didn't cost a lot of money. So, but I still don't want to waste it. Let's see though. I want to smell it. Okay, so. Oh, the atomizer is nice. The perfume comp, um, sprays out pretty even. Mmm. You can definitely smell the cocoa. Like you can smell the chocolate. It's definitely a gourmand. Mmm. It's really sweet. It smells like caramel. Oh, I wish I had the notes, y'all. I'm going to have to look the notes up online. But you can definitely smell the chocolate, like over anything. It smells like chocolate and caramel. Mmm. Ooh, it smells so... I want to spray some on my skin so bad, but I'm not going to use it until tomorrow because I want to see what the lasting power is. But it smells really... Oh, mm, ooh, I want to use it. I'm going to use it tonight. <laughs> I'm going to use it tonight. 
and I'm not going to say anything to hubby. I'm going to spread on and then see what he thinks about it. Because when I used that cherry oil, y'all, he was like, oh my God, you just smell so good. He loved that. Mm, but that smells so good, y'all. It smells just like freaking chocolate and caramel. That's exactly what it smells like. So I'm going to use this probably either tonight or tomorrow morning. All right, y'all. So I'm going to take these things upstairs and then I'm going to come back down here and clean up my kitchen and just wind down for the rest of the evening. And I will holler at you guys in the a.m.